this is a case of purpura. As you see, this patient has, this person has red blotches under the skin and, as we say, chain link all the way down to the, down the feet. As you see, this is called purpura, P-U-R-P-U-R-A. This is caused by um, a platelet problem where the blood is basically bleeding out through the skin. As you see, it's not, it's very smooth, but it's, nonetheless, it's their blood blisters. And um, it's something that he has it all the way through to his toes. <laughs> He's in the hospital right now from this, but as you see, it goes all the way to the toes. The whole entire, all the entire feet are covered with this. So he also had it in his, um, has it in his mouth, which I'm not taking pictures of, but he had like raisin blisters in the mouth, or turn up or blood blisters on the back and the face. He has even spots in the eyes, which, in the whites of the eyes, the face and the body. So. This, what this is caused by is caused, in this case, by a platelet malfunction, an autoimmune, an autoimmune where um, the platelets, platelets were eat, being eaten by the body. The immune system was attacking the body and um, causing this problem. But this type of rash is called purpura. He actually has ITP, idiosyncratic thrombostic cystic per <laughs> per um, no pechia purpura better known as ITP <laughs> sorry it's one of those words that are very hard to pronounce but as you see this is what the kind of thing that happens um, bruises blood bru bris blisters bruises and um, when they tried to poke his arm to take blood, this is what he got. Isn't that lovely? This is what's left of the bruise after four, three days. That was Thursday. Today is, um, this is Monday. So, yeah, bruises all over the darn place. You see the other arm. So this is what's, this is what's left after things are healing. So... Yes, this is, so if you ever have this type of thing, you'll understand. And the treatment for this is steroids. High doses of steroids, as well as, in this his case, an immunoglobin. Immunoglobin to stop the immune system from attacking itself. Order, if you ever get something like this or see something like this, tell this person to go see their doctor. This does not go away by itself. In his case, regular steroids didn't do the job. He ended up going in, like I said, for immune suppressants. It's because what was happening is the immune system was attacking the platelets. Thank you.